Movie review time. Last night, I saw Blade Runner, the sequel, with heartthrob Ryan Hairplug Gosling. Yeah, that's right, I said it. The guy's got plugs, or he's got some help up there. Nobody's hairline goes straight across. You know, you look at somebody without hair plugs, and the hairline looks natural. His did not. That said, he's a good actor. I like Ryan Gosling as an actor, just fine. Harrison Ford was in it, but if you see the commercial saying that it's Ryan Gosling and Harrison Ford, it's true Harrison Ford is in it for like 20% of the movie. Uh, there's also Jared Leto is in the movie. I didn't know he was gonna be in the movie. I think the guy used to be a good actor, or maybe he still is, but he plays like the same, holy son. He plays the same role every time. I'm the weird creepo guy. I just, I play only edgy roles. If you're a good actor, you can do more than one, one type of role. His acting of the role wasn't distracting. It's just the fact that it's like, oh, he's playing the weird creepy guy again. Uh, Jared Leto, get some range, man. So the movie was good action. It had a few little moments of humor, really well filmed, and it was terribly, terribly long. It was so long that I did fall asleep <laughs> in it. Didn't at all get lost by falling asleep. If you need, if you're gonna go watch the movie and you need to go like get popcorn or go to the bathroom, go for it. You will not miss anything. You're gonna miss just some silence of Ryan Gosling looking pensive. Mm, what should I do? Am I human or am I, oh, what was that, a relic? I forget what was the thing, anyways. If you're like a sci-fi nerd and like this is like really your thing and you're not a fan of a storyline moving very fast, then this might be your movie. I actually kind of like slow movies, but this was like molasses. Well, if it was about an hour and a half shorter, it would have been really good, but it wasn't. That's my movie review this week, Blade Runner. See it in a movie theater near you if you need a nap.